considering I'm not actually selling them and they're for a collection, it sort of broke my rule of only getting these figures if they're cheap, and these weren't that cheap. So go, go, go! I'll see you on the other side. Yeah, mate. Up, I topped them up. You topped them up? Yep. Mainly with the Xbox. All right. Since they don't know anything yet, why not? Sorry? Since my kids don't know anything, I'm <laughs> topping them up. Well, they want to get rid of the consoles? Uh, the original Xbox? Yeah, any, any consoles. I reckon they might have a couple. I know they want to hold their, they've got some handheld things. Yep. I know that they're not keen on any of those. No, that's fair enough. But I reckon I have an old Xbox. I'll yeah. see what else they got. Yeah, yeah. Any um, Pokemon games or anything like that as well? Yeah. Yep, yep. My sister did the same thing. What are you doing? Now who was the know? Yeah, yeah. Well, hoarders like me, but um, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's because like I don't grow up. Like yeah. Us, yeah, exactly, exactly. Yeah, no, have a look. Be interested in my... Uh, like Cheers, Luke. Net. Oh, is that it? <laughs> How much you want to bet the red ring? Might as well be because they're going to be absolutely trash. Guess what that is? Can I imagine? Sorry? Can I imagine what that is? Yep. That's uh <laughs> Is there any more in there? What about this one? No, not him. That's a 99 canner. Another one. Animated. <laughs> there you go. What is that? Uh, oh, that's another one. I don't have that one. <laughs> yep. Holy crap. Okay. How much are these? Cool. I'll grab them, but I'll just have a look at what else you got as well. Yeah, no oh, hello. That's cool. That's cool. No, I was missing this cover. It wasn't broken. Yeah, it's just the cover. Julian? Soup packet. What's, uh, what channel do you do? do channel? Oh, this, yeah. Uh, it's called, uh, what's it called? Super Retro. Super Retro Squad. What, what sort of things do you usually use in the Ninja Turtles. Um, Just 90s, 80s. Yeah, basically. Yeah. So stuff I had as a kid that disappeared yeah. that I want back because I'm having a midlife crisis. Yep. Yeah. 
Cheers, man. Thank you. Thanks, dude. Appreciate it. G'day, g'day. G'day. What's going on? Just hanging out. Just hanging out? Boys. Is that all you got left? Uh, no, I've got a couple more left. That's about it, yeah. Yeah, right. You still got Orco? I sort of regretted not getting him. Someone did look at him because they're going, oh, I've got the zip tie for him. There he is. There we go. There we go. Oh, okay, he's got his... Yeah. Ones I had, and I was just thinking about the other day. When yeah. Movie came out, the, ones, the crappy ones, the twin sword guy. What's his name? Um, twin sword guy. Uh, it was just created for the movie specifically. Do you have any other video game stuff on the consoles or anything? No, that's all of that's yeah. That's it. That's it. That's yeah. Not a that's worry. For my uh, yeah, my son. So. Not a problem. He's probably got a gazillion more at, at his place. But <laughs> that's, this is all he's given me so far. Okay. Thank you. Hello. Hello, how are you? Good, I'm the annoying video game guy. <laughs> and I'm the annoying seller that forgets things. <laughs> um, no, I don't have video games today. I'm all good, yeah, that's alright, yeah. we'll try again next time. Please, I'll yeah. see you then. Thank you. Thanks. So what you got here? Uh, three or four, no, don't need it. Well, I mean, that's all that I've got left in my uncanny collection. They're the ones I'm missing. Oh, that's not too many. That's no, that and Spider-Man I've been working on for the past year. Yep. You don't want to get comic books out of vampires? He doesn't even have any tricks. Somebody else has them. Oh. That's pretty good that you only got so few holes to fill. Yeah. The trouble is, it's like an itch. It gets to that point where you can't... Um, you know. I've got... Like, I'm trying to get them now before they're in the MCU. Uh, that's an impressive haul. 40 bucks, whole box of trolls. Oh, you got it, did you? You know the Brontosaurus? Yeah. 10 bucks, savers. Naked, nothing on it, but yeah, just sitting on the Good shelf shit. there. Fuck literally yeah, just like... went, boom. Yeah, 10 bucks. I got that with the box, $70 at Vinnie's. Guy don't write as a oh, mask, you just don't see him. That little small figure range, you yeah. see much of them anymore. Well, as well, it wasn't really shipped out much yeah. to us. Only the third series, which America never got, which, which is why that yeah, yeah, there's why they're so yeah, the yellow after them, the yellow pterodactyl, the yep. one big horn, yeah, yep. which are all the ones I got from my auntie, and the orange like triceratops. My yep. auntie gave me all those for Christmas, so I got the box and everything. That's cool. But those are the most expensive, various transformers, yeah. and the Ice Age range because they ship that straight yeah, yeah. to us too. Yeah. So oh, yeah, but Americans are like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> they are. It's crazy. They are. It's stupid. It's crazy. That's, I'll probably never have them. It no, it's ridiculous. So, it's oh, I got that from the Savers, a bike of mice from Mars motorbike. Oh, oh nice. So I saw that well. yeah. in the fuck it because I looked at that. I don't do motorbikes, but I was like, hang on a second. That's a bike of mice from Mars motorbike. Blah, 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 blah. I got rid of all my Just brothers' ones at the Toy Fair. Me, which yeah, one? Bike more bike of mice. More bike of mice. Battle Toads. Battle Toads bike yeah. racing. Well, if I don't have it, I'd love some bike well, uh, Battle Toads stuff. I was yeah. just, my brother had. I've got, I've got enough stock for a hundred trees. Yeah, yeah, I've already got it. I've already got it. Yeah, I'm, you know, I yeah, forgot to bring them. And no, no, March 20th. For Deadpool vs. Wolverine? No, 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 it's new X-Men. Oh, is a new X-Men coming out? New series with the original Yeah, yeah, yeah X-Men 97. And, um, half the voice. So excited. Actors are all back. Oh, yep. yep. Scott's yep. back. Yep. yep. Wolverine's back. Wolverine's back. All of them back. Morph is now... Try. Not try. You know that cheaper. Non-binary. Non-binary. Which makes sense. He moves. And he's actually going to show that he was an alien looking like Mystique. You know Mystique's always blue. Yeah. He's going to show that he was always afraid of his... Natural self. Natural self. And then use that as that whole discovering people angle thing. That kind of thing. I didn't get it last week. If you don't get it now, I'll get it. That's another one there. <laughs> oh, is that? <laughs> now you have to buy it, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> you have to cheap, but it's a very good background. How much one for it? This side of life as well. Cool.
the 28 size ones. Or 100 for the 60. This guy's cloak. Good? Yeah, they're all good. Enough for a hundred dollars, good though. He goes wrong, wrong, wrong. And we're back in the games room. Julian isn't here. He didn't really get much today. Um, bit of a slow one. I also got a lot, but didn't get a lot. If that makes sense. Anyway, it will in a second. So what do we start off with? So we started our usual swap meet. Uh, not a lot of vendors there. There was another big rotary swap meet up at one of the country towns that we decided not to go to because of travel because of petrol because of living because of money because of all the other stuff that capitalism makes us do and uh as a result not many people around that's okay we still managed to find a vendor selling some really cool stuff i'm looking down because i'm trying to decide what to show you first so these dinosaurs here were a part of the South Australian Museum and other Australian museums. Um, more specifically, the British Museum. Uh, I remember them from when I was a kid. They used to be in the window of the souvenir store and they were uh, just single coloured dinosaurs that you uh, purchased. Uh, I was obsessed with them. Collect them now, even to this day. Coming across them is rather difficult, uh, much like any other collectible from the early 90s or 80s. Um, these are a dollar each, so super happy. I think I only have two out of the four that I got, or five? Uh, I don't know, four or five I got. Anyway, dollar each, really good deal. Also, at that same place, managed to pick up a couple more turtle books. Now, I think I have the annual already, uh, and then this uh, Ninja Turtles book here is basically... Just a story of the first episode. Um, buck each, again, not complaining. Now, the same vendor that I bought He-Man stuff off uh, previously, I went back and had a look at his Orco because for $15, that was a pretty good deal. Unfortunately, one of the kids had, had tried to put a mouth on Orco and it was a bit, uh, bit disastrous, so I decided to leave that. But I did pick up Thunder Punch He-Man. Here he is. He's, I, I, I'm holding a camera. I can't do the Thunder Punch. You, you're going to lose out this time. But he punches, and you better believe there's thunder. Now for, I don't know if it's a regret or not, so I'm collecting the vintage 1977 Star Wars figures uh, when I find them for cheap, because, uh, like, I found them for a buck a couple of weeks back. You may have seen if you subscribe to Super Retro Squad, which you should totally do. Came across a bunch of them. Uh, we got this, uh, I think it's a Death Star droid. Of course, C-3PO, everyone's favourite annoying voiced uh, anti uh, destabilitator is a droid. Everyone's actual favourite droid, the Gronk droid. I still, I still don't think I should be saying that name. Sounds like a slur. Got an R5. He doesn't have a faulty motiv motivator. Pretend I didn't mess that up, that line. I could fix it in editing, but no, you get the raw material. Uh, another R2-D2. And finally, a Jawa, this time with his little uh, hood on. Now, I... I think I overpaid for these. Um, having a look at the comps online, they didn't, but considering I'm not actually selling them and they're for a collection, it sort of broke my rule of only getting these figures if they're cheap and these weren't that cheap. So, <sighs> bit disappointed, really. I'm going to have to take a lesson. Go, go and have a good hard word to myself. Oh, I also got this. Again, I saw it last week. I wasn't going to pass it down. I only paid $4 for it. It's a 1996 sticker book where you used to buy the stickers and the album separately with the X-Men 97 cartoon coming out very soon, which I'm super excited about because that cartoon is the reason I am into comics even to this day. Uh, I, I had to pick it up. I um, don't know where I'm going to put it, but I'll find somewhere. And what you may not have seen on the video because I didn't film it. So if you did see it, you've hacked into my mainframe somehow. So stop that. Uh, managed to get Super Nintendo, a little bit ragged, a little bit uh, yellow, a little bit crusty at the back there, uh, with Donkey Kong, all working, came with the control, all the hookups, got that for $80. Overall, kind of weird day, weather was great, weren't a lot of people out, not a lot of garage sales. Here's hoping we can find some more later, and to make sure we do, you better hit that like button, and subscribe, and tell your friends. Now I'm going to do this thing that I always do, because it's my gimmick.